Hi, and this is Lynn with MI Tinker, and today we are working on this Ryobi pressure washer with the Honda engine. Uh, it's a gas-powered uh, pressure washer that was only used once, and then it was let sit with the gas in it, and now it won't start. So stay with me and see how we're going to drain the gas and get this started again. Let's get to it. So first things first, let's remove this rubber gas hose. I'm use some needle nose pliers. Once they're pinched, you can slide it backward like that. It's gonna start gushing. this way a little more you can see that it's draining into the cup. All right that's the last of it. It wasn't too much. I'm gonna try and tip it to see if any more comes out. All right that seems to be dry. Okay, now we're gonna take a look at where the carburetor is and it is right here. But we'll take that nut off and see if there's any gas left to drain in the carburetor. I have a low profile 10 millimeter socket wrench. Got a rag ready. Hopefully there's not much in there. Okay, nothing in there. Put that back in. Okay, we got that in. Here's a tinker tip for you. With small engines, it's a really good idea to use ethanol free gas or rec gas and you can get that at most gas stations. Uh, with this particular Honda engine, you can use up to 10% ethanol, um, but again, for the longevity of the gas and for the motor, an ethanol-free gas is recommended, AKA rec gas. The fuel line should be in the off position to avoid flooding the carburetor. Time for fresh fuel, and I'm just going to put a little bit in enough to get it started. Now we can turn the gas line to the open position. We can put it in this choke position and turn the engine on. start. Okay, the next thing we're going to try is to open up the air filter, spray a little bit of starting fluid. Now let's give it a try. Hey, thanks for watching. And if you've got your own tips as to how to start a hard to start engine, let me know. I'd love to hear it in the comments below and hit that like button and subscribe. That'll help our channel grow. Thanks so much.